Stone rocket went straight up. But the capsule didn't have enough speed to go into orbit, so it came back down. Essentially a triangle, Earth, suborbit, Earth. That math was known. That took Shepard, took Grissom. That cannot take Glenn. Now, the Atlas rocket, that can push us into orbit. Goes up, delivers the capsule into an elliptical orbit. Earth's gravity keeps pulling at it, but it's going so fast, it keeps missing the Earth. That's how it stays in orbit. Now, getting it back down, that's the math we don't know. Yes, Catherine. So the capsule will spin around the Earth forever because there's nothing to slow it down? That's right. It's slowing it down at precisely the right moment, at precisely the right amount, that's the task. Yes, Catherine. So it needs to move from an elliptical orbit to parabolic orbit. Yes. That, that's the go, no go. Now, at this point, it's a pinhead. We bring him in too soon. He burns up on reentry. That's right. We bring him in too late. He's pushed out of Earth's gravity. And any changes to mass, weight, speed, time, distance, friction, or puff of wind would alter the go, no go. And we start our calculations over. Yes. So we need to be able to choose this reentry point. Now, this go, no go, this has to be exact. Sam. These are the latest redstone numbers in current capsule data. Obviously, we know the launch spot. Uh, Pentagon briefing should illuminate where the Navy needs the recovery zone. Then we work backwards from there. And the rest is on us, so let's get to work.